Bitcoin against US dollar has risen in value. We can see the price has made a breakout from this range and also this great supply zone where the price has reached and reached 379, almost three. Yeah, it has reached $38,000. Now the price has bounced from this great supply zone. We can see the price drop it down, but the price continue to move even more up so the price is in between this greater resistance and this support area and it also is following this uptrend trend line which is visible much more clearly on the weekly time frame we can see that the price is following this uptrend trend line and the price has reached this confluence of resistance where i'm expecting the price will try to reach even further on around 38 38.533 visible here on the chart now let's see on the monthly time frame how this looks monthly breakout bullish breakout here uh, has been confirmed for now with this bullish candle but i was expecting that the price could drop down and then bouncing from this great support and then moving further up but the price has continued to move up with this strong bullish momentum but this is the monthly time frame where we have two plus weeks until this month ends so there is a possibility that the price returns back down confirm this bullish breakout and then finding great support uh, before a further move out but this also is not mandatory that the price confirms this bullish breakout in order to continue to move up what can happen also is the price continues to move even more higher but very important level we can see it here is around 38500 this is a great resistance price level where we'll see what price can do very important level for the monthly time frame is that the price stays above this one here which is a monthly confluence of support and resistance that is 34500 price level and there is a possibility that the price could reach this one 38500 in this month which it was very close uh, this week there is also a possibility that the price reach this area here 3990 which is 40000 this month but the, this is visible on much more clearly on the weekly and also daily analysis but we can see when the price was heading up there is a week that has touched for sure this area so I'm expecting that the price will continue to move up and I'm expecting that the price will reach 38500 uh, 38, and there is possibility to reach 40,000. Now from there the price could stop but if the price would like to continue to move up the monthly time frame needs to break and close above 38500. We will see much more clearly on the weekly time frame how this looks. We can see this is the very important level for the weekly time frame, but also this one here is 39200. We can see in the past the price has touched this one area many times and also where the price could go up is around this one 40,000 for sure and also 40,700. I'm expecting that the price will reach this area on the on the weekly time frame and then we will see what happens because the price needs to make a break to the upside but we can also be sure that there will be high uh, selling pressure here which is a supply zone which will push the price down when the price was heading in the past to this price level we can see that the price is bouncing very hard and go down touching this area which is uh, 30,000 if you remember i have mentioned after the price made a breakout here i was expecting that the price will make a drop down to this area confirming this breakout as a valid one going back to this previous resistance now acting support and then continue to move up this area is this one 30,000. so if we go to the weekly time frame we can see in the past that the price has done right that and then continue to move even more higher in the past when the price was going up we can see it here the price was has easily going up and this was also a downtrend so we cannot uh, check anymore this uh, this great resistance in the case when the price is moving up this is the second time when the price was uh, moving from the lower price levels to this area and then finding our great resistance and then support to continue to move up this is the second time when the price is uh, doing that and that means the price is in, in the uptrend where the price is coming from the lower price level and reaching this area so i'm expecting there will be probability a great sell-off around this area around 40,000, and then going to the 30,000. now we'll see much more clearly on the daily time frame these price levels let's do it like this 
so we can see how this looks. On the daily time frame, we can see that the price is moving up, forming this and following this uptrend channel, and then the price will have hard time around this 40,000. We can see much more clearly where the price uh, is here, at around 38,500, which is a very important level. So I'm expecting that the price will touch with a week around 39,000 on the daily time frame. I have mentioned 40,000 on the weekly, but on the daily time frame, I have I am seeing this as a probability, very high probability for the price. After that, I'm expecting the price will drop down, but as it looks right now, I'm expecting the price will continue to move up for the next week. Very important level for the price is 40,000 and also 38,500 to continue to move up. We can see if the price makes a breakout to the upside on the daily time frame above 38,500, the next one where the price could stop is around this one 40,800. On the monthly weekly analysis, I have seen 40,700. That is then the maximum level for the price to reach and then seeing the price dropping down around 30,000, which is also visible here. So we will see what happens, but for now everything looks bullish and I'm expecting uh, the price to reach around 38,500 next week and also probably even more higher. That is all from today's analysis. I hope you enjoyed. If you have any question, feel free to leave a comment. If you like the analysis, click the like button and subscribe. See you next time and a happy trading.